Hey guys, it's me, and uh, I'm reviewing Edge, and this figure is, like, recommended from me, because, like, it's just so cool, because his, uh, his head scan's perfect, and his uh, double hinge knees, legs move apart. I like these a lot better, but they cost a lot more. They're, well, they're only $5 more, so that's pretty sweet and this moves and sometimes with these it's harder for them to stand than the other guys and this moves right here all around whatever and his tattoos are really detailed and colored and everything and his jacket like it's so detailed and it it's so like stiff that you can it, edges arms can't even move in the jacket and his glasses, like, they look so goofy on him when he puts them on. That's why I don't put them on him. So, that's what I don't like about the glasses. Like, it's just, it's just dumb. And the front of this packaging says Elite, Elite Collection and Edge. And then World Wrestling uh, Entertainment Series 8. And it comes with the um, following figures. Uh, Drew McIntyre, Sheamus, Evan Bourne, William Regal, and Undertaker. Has the information and edge and, and a signature. But what I don't like is that on just the regular figures, it doesn't have, like, edge can move a lot more. He's the one that costs more. So, um, it um, she has information, but... Um, Chris Jericho doesn't because he's not the special edition, which I thought is just so not fair. Like, they should have it on every box. Like, on all my non-elite series. Like, it has it on the rocks, and, but it doesn't have it on Rey Mysterio, Alberto Del Rio, and um, Chris Jericho. So, that's my review on The Edge. See ya.